Santa Clara Ivan's fire and rescue crews used berry pistols and drip torches to light fires in the Lob Pond area just west of Snow Canyon High School. The crews from the small neighboring bedroom communities in Washington County recently merged their efforts in the best interest of the citizens. In, in the merger of any kind, there are uh, resources and assets that we, we utilize between the two departments. We provide a uh, larger air coverage area as well as uh, additional firefighters to respond. Uh, it is a uh, makeup of uh, paid firefighters, uh, majority of them are volunteer firefighters. and so. Uh, between the different uh, equipment and apparatuses, we'll be able to provide Santa Clara and Ivans uh, a response time uh, that is uh, during the days uh, since we have full-time firefighters as well as medics. Steve Ikuda recently took over the position as the Santa Clara Ivans Public Information Officer. He also acts as the safety incident officer for this prescribed burn, which is part of an annual event to mitigate high fuel levels. Uh, as you know, we have fuels in here ranging all over from cattails to some cheatgrass. Uh, it, it grows every year and we come in at a time where the weather's just right, the winds are cooperating to where we can actually do some fuel mitigation so it doesn't become a issue uh, during our wildland season. Ikuda said it's a good idea for residents to also make sure they have defensible space around their homes in case a fire were to start in their neighborhoods. As you can see, even uh, with it being uh, the first week of April, they are dry. Uh, the cattails that we were just burning or will continue to burn burns very hot and very quick. You'll get a lot of uh, heat off of it. But once it burns quick, it dies down, as you can see, a lot of the blackened area behind me. Between the two departments, there are about 80 volunteers with about six full-time firefighter paramedics. Ikuda said the new merger between the two departments will allow for better response times. Um, um, provide uh, response times for both our departments. We've, in the past, if we had a structure fire where we needed mutual aid, we would always call either Ivan's or St. George or vice versa where um, Ivan's would call us to respond. And so between uh, the two cities, city council, the managers, the mayors, um, along with the uh, fire chiefs of both uh, Ivan's and fire, Santa Clara, they were able to see the, the pros of, of the merger. While many of the volunteers don't get paid at all, Others may receive a stipend for six to eight dollars per call. Ikuda took the day off from his full-time job at the hospital as a matter of giving back to his community and taking time to prevent serious fires in the future. Ikuda said the merger isn't expected to cost either city extra money. In Santa Clara, Melissa Anderson, CEC News.